Participation in the fear beforehand was worse than the actual <laughs> plunge. Um, so now I feel uh, like it's almost tropical. <laughs> That's because your nerves are all messed up. Look at that. Dozens of Portlanders braced the rain and cold this morning for the annual Valentine's Day dip. Going into the Willamette River, you know why they wave their arms. They're hoping helicopters will come over and rescue them, Joe. They made their way to the chilly Willamette. I think those folks are praying. Uh, the event's organized by the River Advocacy Group Human Access Project. The goal is to celebrate the cleanliness of the Willamette and help convince people the river is safe to swim in. There's a lot of people, you know, still in the community that believe every time it rains, sewage overflows into the Willamette. Well, guess what? It's been six months. I mean, it's just the data. It is what it is. So hopefully that makes people feel hopeful. That change is the result of Portland's $1.4 billion big pipe project, which was completed back in 2011. Before then, sewage overflowed into the river an average of 50 times a year. Now, after a billion, eh, it only happens four or five times a year. <laughs>